Mango and Clint on Hot Ones. I think that'd be great. I think me and Clint are just like, it's me way over here and Clint way over here, but you put us together and for some reason it just works. Uh, I'm Mango and I'm reading some of your internet comments. Hopefully uh, they're not too stupid, but uh, something tells me they might be. All right, first one. Yeah, pre pretty dumb. Um, this is actually my boy Mike. It's pretty funny actually, yeah. <laughs> I get behind it. You saved Melee. I think people <laughs> blow that out of proportion sometimes. They're like, oh, Melee would be dead without you. I think Melee is such a sick game that I, I don't like to put myself above it because I think Melee's, it would be fine. It would take a hit and I think I have saved Melee a few times, but I think the game's so good that like, you know, it puts us in a spot to where I can even save it to begin with. I always give credit to the game first because I love the game. This guy says, fuck USA, why does every fat American have a flag in his house? <laughs> You see it in the background? I have one behind me, I have like eight in my house. And it's because we love our country. I don't get why, like, we can be a little annoying about it, but I think there's nothing wrong loving where you're from. I think you accept the flaws, but you know, there's nothing wrong with loving where you're from. Melee is good, but Ultimate's way better. No. Bengal fans are like Eagle fans, in it for long haul because that one win feels so good. I've actually become the Eagles, I realize. Like, I usually underperform, kind of let everyone down. But uh, being an Eagles fan, I'm diehard. I'm always gonna cheer, you know. I'm always gonna love my team, win or lose, and I will always get mad at them, disappointed, whatever. But I think just being like that, it's kind of rubbed off, and like, Mango fans, we really, we're very similar. But uh, you know, we're always die hard, and uh, you know, when we win, it's like, it's always worth it. No matter how long I go without winning, it's, when I, do, when I get it done, just like the Eagles, every time, it's like, it's always worth it. Are you losing weight? Uh, no. Drunk December just happened, but I, I lose my beer weight pretty quick, so. My mediums are still kind of fitting, so I'm, I'm doing okay, I think. Mango's great, but he's such an asshole. I actually think I'm a total sweetheart, um, if you get to know me. I think I'm actually 0% an asshole. But I guess I can come off that way if you don't know me, but I promise you, I'm, I'm not. I miss old Mango, straight from the go Mango. Chop up the soul Mango, set on his goals Mango. I hate the new Mango, the bad mood Mango, the always rude Mango, spaz in the news Mango. Ludwig has been milking content that isn't his since forever. It's a good song. This was first Fox talk of the year. It was, uh, I forgot when I played, I think it was like the second or third of January. Had not played Fox. This was literally the first time I picked up Fox. And um, yeah, I just destroyed Dewan. Like everything went perfect. It was, I even laughed in the clip. It's pretty funny. They say year of the goat. And my man uh, purified says goat. Um, I'm feeling pretty good about this year, honestly. So uh, I don't want to get everyone's hopes up because that, that's actually the mango is get everyone's hopes up. And the last few years, I always said I just lied to them. I just told them what they wanted to hear. But uh, I think this year, I've won. I won some big tournaments last year, and I think now there's some uh, there's some truth in it. So we'll see. Alex19 says you made that look easy. Yes. This is what 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 is this? I don't even get it. I'm I'm, get, I'm getting old. I don't get it. If Mango was president, he would rename the United States to the Mango Nation. I'm so down for that. Same. So happy I won't forgot to steal towels from the hotel. Just remember to win again for them towels. Um, yeah, I, so I don't know if C9 gets charged for those towels, but uh, I always take like two. I, I love hotel towels and then I don't have to buy, because I travel, what, six to 12 times a year, give or take somewhere in there. You take two, I'll, I'll, all of a sudden at the end of the year, I got like 20 towels. It's like, it's a no brainer. And then if anything, C9 gets charged, but they haven't told me anything about it, so. I'm definitely gonna keep yoinking them towels. I don't understand why this game is still being played. Melee has reached its peak and there's nothing more to be discovered. I don't even want to address this because it's so obviously a bad troll. This picture, I love this picture. I always say this is the best day of my life. Went to the Super Bowl, spent 30 grand, tickets, hotel, everything, and the Eagles ended up winning. And um, if I think about that day, I could still get water eyed like right now. It's just best day of my life, I always say. And uh, I like, I will probably never unpin this picture just because uh, every time I look at it, I just instantly get happy. Mango save melee and. And now I better go save the Eagles with that vert. Uh, unfortunately, uh, my quarterback got cheap shot and I don't think I could have helped at all. Hungry Box exists, Mango Fox. Well, for a while I destroyed H. I was like the original Fox to like destroy H Box. Then he kind of got it back. But I think this year we're three, four. So hopefully, uh, hopefully bringing it back to, to exactly that. Yo, why is Mango looking like a homeless Jesus? Cause when you make enough money, you can look like whatever you want. It doesn't matter. Who's gonna tell me anything? I love Mango, but why he look like a pimped out hobo? Because I can. I, I, this is my office. Uh, no one tells me what I can wear or dress like, so I can get away with it. I also like looking like this because I feel like it makes like people. It makes some people mad. 
I like sticking it to the man whenever I can. Can anyone please explain to me what a Norwalk is? Norwalk is just uh, where we grew up. I have the tattoo. Actually, down the block, you can see the, the square. I live in Norwalk. All my good friends, you know, born and raised. Not, not born, but uh, raised here. Joey was born and raised here. Um, Alex lived here a lot of his life. Um, now it's funny, Johnny and Chillin live here, so we've got a whole little squad. Uh, but Norwalk's a city. I don't know how serious it is, but uh, <laughs> it's where we live, where we grew up. Check it out, Google it. Wish I had a friendship like Mango and Lucky. That's all, that's all, that's all you need to know. So you're saying Mango was too good to make the team. Uh, well, it was great actually for a while, because my CS streams, I always put C9B team, but we didn't have a team for a while. So technically I was, I was kind of a team for a while. Well, I think this team's killing it. So I, I don't think I'm too good. I'm actually not good enough, but I think, <laughs> I think at first I might've been. Don't be Mango, two thumbs up. I always tell people they shouldn't be like me. I didn't do well in school, dropped out of community college. I always just say I had the talent and charisma to be me. And most people don't have that, so stay in school. Just slept 11 hours, ready to play Melee like a virgin all week. Genesis already next week. Uh, yeah, I've been playing Melee like six hours. Usually, um, my stamina's gone up. Like last year, I can only play Melee like two to four hours on stream. But uh, I found a good like formula where like, I kind of just ignore chat and like kind of focus more. So I've been able to play like six, seven hours and uh, yeah, especially when I got good sleep because all of December I was not sleeping well. So uh, yeah, pretty much. I'm, I'm literally, after this is done, I'm gonna go play more melee. Mango's ego always gets me through the day. I think to be good at anything, you have to have at least some sort of ego. I'm pretty honest, like a lot of time when I lose, I'm never claiming to like be the best or anything. Like I think my ego, a lot of times just to be funny for show, the grand scheme of things, I like know where I stand. And I do think to like be good at things, you have to have kind of an ego, especially the way I play melee. So, uh, you know, you gotta, you gotta have the ego, it's just about balancing it. Last one, this is when I met Squishy, had the pleasure of flying out to Croatia a few months ago to shoot the new Cloud9X Puma clothing line. Gonna be posting pictures on that trip over the next few days. Gotta meet a bunch of the other C9 guys, including one of the people I've looked up to for a long time. Me and Squishy are just little BFS. I actually haven't talked to him in a while, but uh, I always say that's the most mature person I've ever met. He's like, you talk to him, he's got everything figured out. I'm like, dang. When I was 18, I was such a dumbass, but this guy, he's legit. And uh, yeah, I'm happy he's C9. He's my boy. And now this just reminded me that I should probably message him sometime. And this is my advice to everybody. You should never take the internet seriously. I think, I think most people, there's the people who just want to be funny and like you can see it. And there's the people who want to be mean. But at the end of the day, it's like, like, these people don't know you. It's just like, who cares? Like, I always just take it in the funny way and my life's better because my life is literally the internet and I just don't let it, don't let it get you down because otherwise you just, you fall into their trap. And I always say the internet can smell blood. They see something hurts you, like whatever. And then they just, they're like a shark in the water. So, you know, just have, don't, don't take it too seriously and you'll be fine. He is a cut above the rest in regard to overall character development. This is about me. Uh, yeah. <laughs>